The Victorian Premier has welcomed Prime Minister Scott Morrison's decision to reopen the international border, but believes three COVID-19 vaccines should be made mandatory for arrivals from overseas. Victorian Premier Daniel Andrews has flagged concerns about the vaccine requirements for international travellers ahead of the border reopening to tourists. On Tuesday, Mr Andrews admitted the advice he was receiving told him three doses of a COVID-19 vaccine was the safest way to reopen the international borders. All the international evidence, all the advice that I get from our team is that three doses is what's required in order to be as safe as you can be in order to be protected, he said. The comments came the day after Prime Minister Scott Morrison announced the international borders would reopen for anyone who has received two shots of a coronavirus vaccine on February 21. It will be two doses. There are various arguments around the world for three doses. Two doses is what the chief medical officer says is sufficient, Mr Morrison said. Victorian Premier Daniel Andrews believes Adagio will recommend the definition for fully vaccinated be changed to three doses. Picture, Diego Fedel Getty Images. Prime Minister Scott Morrison announced Australia's international borders would be reopened to travellers with two doses from February 21. Picture, Rohan Thompson Getty Images. Stream the latest news on COVID-19 with Flash. Stream more than 20 global and local news sources. New to Flash? Try one month free now. Despite Mr Morrison's comments, Mr Andrews admitted the government would likely be waiting on advice from the Australian Technical Advisory Group on immunisation. On the issue of two, three-year doses, whatever it finishes up being, that's a matter for Adagy in the first instance, he said. I'm sure that the Commonwealth government will reserve the right to change its view based on advice that comes from experts. Adagy must be getting very, very close to making that decision. Mr Andrews believes Adagy will recommend to National Cabinet, which is expected to meet on Thursday, the definition of a fully vaccinated person be changed from two doses to three doses. I think it's highly likely that the weight of evidence suggests that a booster or a third dose is not really an optional extra, he said. It's critically important, and it's not just for now it's also for what comes at us when the weather turns, later in the year all of those things. In Victoria the requirement for residents to enter hospitality venues and sporting events is still only two shots. Mr Andrews has mandated a booster jab for workers in high-risk settings such as health, aged and disability care, emergency services, and food distribution workers. The Premier welcomed the Prime Minister's move to reopen the international borders saying it was good for the economy, good for jobs. That's something that we fully support, the fact that being fully vaccinated remains a requirement, that's obviously a really, really good outcome, and it's about getting back to normal as best we can in the midst of a global pandemic with these variants of concern," he said.